Thousands of students surrounded Thailand's Ministry of Education and heckled the education minister when he came in to speak to them. This is the latest in the ongoing series of anti-government protests there. The high school students demanded better education and said that the administration of Thailand's Prime Minister Prayochan Ocha should step down. Student-led protests have continued every day for more than a month, demanding a new constitution and an end to the harassment of activists. Tensions have risen over the last few weeks with authorities arresting three activists. They were released on bail after being charged with sedition and violating the COVID-19 rules. Some students have also called for reforms to curb the powers of the king, Mahavairulongkorn, over the constitution. The student-led movement had already declared three main demands, holding new elections, amending the new constitution amending the constitution and ending the intimidation of critics of the southeast asian country which has experienced decades of protests punctuated by military coups about 400 students protested they were wearing school uniforms with white ribbons which is the symbol of the protest movement the school students raised anti-government slogans and gave the three finger salute which has become a sign of resistance against the ruling establishment some students even tied white bow ties to the gates of the ministry when the thai education minister natafal tepuswan appeared the students jeered and booed him he went ultimately uh, to uh, take a listen in to what they had to say and uh, address the concerns of the students This wave of pro-democracy protests began after the 2019 elections, which gave the general turn to Prime Minister Prayocha Nocha another four years in office. The pro-democracy activists have been demanding abolition of laws which protect the country's monarchy.